Today, even those who live in rural areas have access to all modern amenities, including satellite TV and even two-way satellite internet. Not so long ago, a TV set used to be a rare and valuable possession. Every evening, the whole family would gather around it to watch news or a movie. Now people can buy several TV sets. One can watch TV not only in bedroom, but also while cooking in the kitchen. Still, one issue remains. How can we split TV signals into different TV sets. There are three possible layouts for a home TV cable system, a daisy chain, a herringbone and the combination of both. They vary in the way the TV sets are connected. In a daisy chain connection, the TV sets are connected with the help of TV sockets only. They are successively fixed on the walls in the house. There are bypass and terminal sockets with signal attenuation of 12 to 16 decibel and 1.5 decibel respectively. It's important not to mix them up the signal can be weakened considerably. The antenna lead in a TV set should be connected to the TV socket in the same way the plug is inserted into an electric circuit. Only in this case we use a TV plug. In a herringbone layout we create a separate network tab for each TV set with the help of one or several splitters. To determine the number necessary for a network one should take into account the layout of the TV sets and the minimum length of the cable. Today we are going to take a closer look at the second connection layout. You will need a cable and a splitter. We should remember that there are two types of splitters, designed either for regular TV or for F sockets. If the splitter you bought is designed for a regular TV socket, there should be no problems with assembling. If you use splitters designed for F sockets, your TV cables will have to be improved a little. First, let's remove the old TV sockets, then let's lay the cable screen on the cable isolation. Now let's take the F socket, put the cable inside it and clamp the enclosure with pliers. After that the cable with an F socket can be hooked up to our coupler. To each output jack of the splitter as many cable sections are connected as the number of TVs in the house. That's it, your TV cable system is ready.